All right, everybody, here is a huge step forward for me for being a successful reefer. I went to BRS and picked up this RODI unit, and this is a six filter system. It has a sediment filter, two carbon blocks, one RO membrane, and two deionization uh, canisters and the big importance about having two DI canisters is what one doesn't catch the other one will eliminate and it took me about 30 minutes to install this uh, the big reason why it took the extra time is because I got a little bit crazy with the hose routing and making that look clean the only extras that I had to pick up that didn't come in the kit was this Y fitting. I picked this up at Lowe's and I also like it has these ball valves so I can turn on and off um, my RODI unit by the flick of this switch. And this utility garden hose adapter actually came in the BRS um, RODI kit or system. And yeah, can't wait to use it. Can't wait to make some super clean water and just be successful first time flicking the switch let's see what happens Ooh, yeah now we're cooking what's coming out of the reverse osmosis system is it's hovering about 20 i don't know what switches back and forth, but it's like about 23 uh, TDS. And we still haven't got water to the bucket yet. It's sent it to the second stage right now. And as soon as it starts dispensing it to the bucket, I'll see what kind of TDS we have coming out the second membrane. Here we go. We got water. And the TDS is reading zero parts per million. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and let it do its thing. Um, I'm gonna let it fill this five gallon bucket up. This first round of water, I'll probably throw it away because the filters are breaking in. They had air in the system. Anything could have got by. And because I just wanna take some extra precaution, but the next bucket I make will actually be for my system. And that's super exciting because water on demand is the best all right everybody here's the first five gallons made with my own rodi system this is a game changer no more lugging buckets to the lfs and lugging them in the house i can make water at any time any day whenever i need it complete game changer all right so here's a little bit of a conclusion for this video i've been running this system for about a week now I've made about 40 gallons of water and some tips are make sure you flush your membrane for at least two to three minutes after it's been setting for a couple days to one, maintain the membrane and two, to cut down on the bacterial growth inside of that membrane. Also, after the system made about 15 gallons of water, I noticed that the TDS coming from the RODI system is setting at two and coming out of the second canister is still zero. So we're good there. And also it's very simple. It seems intimidating. It was intimidating for me. That's why it's taking this long to get one, but it's very simple, very easy. All right, thanks again for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, go ahead and hit my logo. Also, turn on that notification bell to get further updates. And if you haven't seen any of these videos, go ahead and click and watch. Thank you.